so I um, decided to go up to Mount Morris Park, aka Marcus, Marcus Garvey Park, and um, practice. I was having, I was struggling with myself all day, and this is the best thing I could do to help myself. First of all, when I got there, it was empty, and then this guy decided he wanted to sit where I wanted to film. Um, I only filmed myself because I wanted to be accountable for myself. And um, I practiced. And while I was just doing my thing, this dog came out of nowhere. Just, you'll see. I was getting, getting into my chi, doing my thing. First of all, I didn't have enough space. So I'm like, all right, I got enough space for three steps. And then right there, I was like, at the steps, I didn't want to break my bow. As soon as I do that, and I, they come the dog. I didn't want to hit the dog. So I had to stop and watch. The guy who owned the dog was surprised I didn't like run away or whatever. I just started over. Try to give myself a little more room. That didn't seem to be working out. My cheat was off, but I started over. I didn't even really know where I was looking because the camera wasn't watching me. The camera wasn't facing me, if that makes sense. And then the guy and the dog got the nerve to sit behind me while I'm trying to practice. I'm here thinking there's nobody going to be up here. No one's going to be up here to bother me. But this guy sit, sat there the whole time. So I'm speed it up for you. And I'm mad that I got the wrong angle. I turned the camera the wrong way. Well, the way that I thought it would work. But I cut off my legs in this. I got to finish my cottons. I just played around a little bit. I act like he wasn't there. And then that guy passed me. I was like, you go, girl. <laughs> I had no idea so many people would just be wandering up there. This is a new background. This wasn't there before that platform. But I just tried to do my thing. And release stress and tension and just be myself. I love karate. It makes me feel good. Especially after like a stressful day or just struggling with myself. I tried to change the camera and I made it worse. <laughs> you can't see my legs. I was trying to make sure my stances were right. Just playing around and just stretching it out. I love my bow staff. I'm just trying to do my thing. We got a tournament coming up and I just want to be prepared. Had to put my hair up, just do these cottons because I didn't want to respect myself with my hair. I always start with Gay Saku Cho because it's like my favorite, one of my favorite older, younger cottons. Meaning in the top, the new, the uh, beginning cottons. Just open me up and then I did Concago to redeem myself. I didn't mess up the first cut I'm just saying. And then I stretch it out. You can't see me stretching. You only see my head right now. That was swag. But I ended up doing um, she show she. Um, after I did that, of course, I had to stretch it out. Just play around sometimes. Have a little space. I had to think like, okay, I'll do she show shit now. I wish you could see my legs. I wanted to make sure that I was on point with my stances, but it felt good because I could do this kata with my eyes closed. And then I stretched a little more just to make sure I was good. And that guy behind me was like staring the whole time. Like, ain't nobody really messing with me. So I'm good.
I don't even know what's going on with this, but uh, I had a good time today. The Dreamer.